The next thing you wanna do, once your grid is centered on your design, is get a piece of chalk and pick a color that is really going to contrast with your t-shirt color so that you can see it. So you wanna put your hand flat down. You wanna put some weight on this grid so that when you're pushing against it with the chalk, it's not moving. And you don't wanna pick it up. You wanna make sure that you have your t-shirt placed so that you can reach all the way around it without picking up and moving it. And these chalk lines that you're drawing are gonna be the lines that you cut on next. So you can see I have, it's a little bit faint there, but I can still see well enough that that is where I'm going to cut. I'm gonna leave my piece flat. And when we use our scissors, we wanna make sure that this bottom part stays flat against the cutting surface. We don't wanna pick this up. So we wanna leave it as flat as possible when we're cutting, and that will give us the most accurate cuts. Take your time with this. This is the most important thing. If you cut correctly, it doesn't matter if you make sewing mistakes. You can fix your sewing mistakes. You can't fix your cutting mistakes. And once again, you know, now that this is fused, I can turn it. You always wanna be cutting away from you instead of around like that. You won't have accurate cuts like that. Yes.